What is going on, guys? It's Tommy today. <clears throat> so about that, I've got a sort of throat. Um, basically, um, I'm showing you a tutorial today on how to make a collage photo. Um, this is just the Twitter uh, YouTube channel that banner I just finished editing. I've got some uh, scare free photos in there. Like a little collage, but today I'm going to show you how to make a picture collage like my YouTube profile picture. <clears throat> I will try to mute the mic every time I cough, um, just so it's not annoying for you. Right, so first I want to have Photoshop, any Photoshop will do, as long as it's not CS2 because I don't have some of these features. Right, so what I want to do, you want to go to File, oops. So you want to go to File, New, and then you just want Default Photoshop Slice, so 16 by 12 in centimeters. Right, I'll click OK. So you got like a nice square. Right, next you want to do is you want to create a layer. So just back clicking this one. And you have a layer one, but then you have to then you need to unlock your background. So just double tap the padlock and it should go. Then remain, then oops. Then go proceed, go back to layer one. Right, next you want to get your pen tool right there but you, want, but you want to make it sharp before that on your brush you have it on I think it's about 28 by 12 maybe 22 just so it's not thick so you just click and it makes it look square and then click there that's it and then click there so you've got like a half triangle right so then you want to uh, right click and then click straight path make, sometimes I think it'll be on pencil make sure it's on brush click ok no 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 wait my mistake make sure your colour is on black and I think this brush needs to be a bit maybe about 21 right uh, pen tool, stroke path, Love it, right. Then you want to click backspace twice, and there you go. There's your first triangle wave picture gonna go. Right, so you can move it about. We can put it just because it's around, but I'm just gonna keep it there. Right, and you want to file and open. By the way, you have to have some pictures ready to do this. So you pick it, pitch you like, and it kind of pops up here. And you want to like grab this tab and then smash it in, just like swipe it really hard into the other one, and then just drag it on like that. Right now we can get to work. As you can probably see, it's just it's going over the black line. So you want to uh, get, so you want to left click and hold on layer two and drag it down to so see the line under underneath layer one and click it off. One click, and it goes behind it. And then you want to like, you can re-image it or whatever you want it to go, make it a little bit bigger. And it's a picture I've chosen Fallout 4. Uh, oh. There. Right, then you just want to click apply. And then it'll like, make it unpixelated. Next you want to get your, you go to your eraser or rubber tool oh, no. to adjust that. Right now you want to go to your eraser or rubber tool and then just start getting rid of these. Make sure it's on full hardness. I'm going to get rid of the background a bit. Maybe make it a bit bigger. All harnesses don't look I put it on there a harness it blends it in like it like fades it out a bit. So you want on full hardness. And then this is it where it's a little bit tricky but sometimes it's, it's quite easy. You need to go around the black 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 line. But once you get some practice, it's really not even that hard. Sometimes if you mess up like that, just click Ctrl and Z, not redo it, but like undo it. 
If you're a perfectionist like me, you want everything to go perfect. You'll be going back a lot if you make mistakes. Like the littlest bump inside of it, I'll be going back like four steps. Like, Um, right, I'm just going to cut this bit out. I've done it. Um, and now we just want to go create a new layer. You don't just go jump in with a pen tool because it'll read it as layer 2. You don't want that because if you do that, the picture will not go underneath it for some reason, so you want to make a new layer, so it's its own layer. Then you should click at the end of it, and just put it anywhere, so like there. Right, and then just the same stroke path, okay, double backspace, file, open, and then we're going to get this skate 3 one. A little skate 3, I hope we make a skate 4. Then you want to minimise it a bit. Drag it on, so it's, oh, that's not good. Drag it on. Yeah, don't forget to change to your bloody pen tool again. Alright. Right, then you just want to go to your res tool. Right, some people worry that when you rub this on, it'll erase that one. It's not because it's on its own layer. Look. If it was on layer 2, it would. But I'm not. I'm on layer 4. So it won't rub out. Right, so I'll see you when I've done this next one. So that you just want to continue them steps, and then you will do it. Remember, create a new layer. I'm gonna put it there. Um, so I'm not gonna buy me doing it all, me you know, like creating a new layer, etc. I'm just gonna uh, cut the video. So when you next see the next bit of fo footage is when it's all finished. So I'll see you then, guys. See you soon. So there we have it guys, that is how you make a collage photo, um, if you did get stuck just rewind this video, <clears throat> there's a bit you got stuck on and then just replay it, so hope you did enjoy this video guys, <clears throat> if you did leave a like, um, don't forget to subscribe, um, comment what other videos I should do, like any more tutorials if this helped you, um, I'll see you in the next video guys, so, See you later. Goodbye.